getting back into the air from the 221st Helicopter Squadron of the Czech Air Force. This Air Force's first participation, as I was saying, in a Duxford event, the Mill My 35, better known as the Hind. The Czech Air Force is deeply proud of the wartime connections between its present day units and those that served as part of the wartime Royal Air Force and you can see that from the colour scheme on this particular My 35 which salutes the only Czechoslovak bomber squadron of World War II, number 311 squadron. It flew both Vickers Wellingtons and Consolidated Liberators and on one side of the aircraft has been painted a depiction of a Wellington, on the other side a Liberator. This helicopter's base at Namesh nad Oslavu holds the traditions of number 311 squadron and so it is that those markings are carried so proudly by the Mi-35 now performing enhanced by Snoke, a solo display the NATO alliance with a tiger or nowadays also other forms of big cat in their emblems. All of these helicopters have been fully upgraded to NATO standards. There was a time when the thought of Heinz operating as part of NATO was unthinkable, but now since the late 1990s it's been reality. But this is to be the last appearance at a British air show this weekend of the Hind in Czech Air Force service because they're due for retirement around the turn of the year. Very sad. 
candidate for Czech Air Force. When the last examples of this mighty machine are out of service. Putting the undercarriage down there, in fact, you are my 35 models in the production in Russia have been equipped with a fixed undercarriage as opposed to retractable.